Okay, so just a review very quickly. First table we just went over is sales budget. So you have at the end the blue line you want to transfer to income statement at $240,000. Middle table here for income statement you will only need to pull $168,000 cost of goods sold portion. All the others are still important but we're learning this later when we get to balance sheet, cash, budget, cash budgets. Okay, and then we have all the operating expenses. You'll be copying those blue lines, adding together the variable expenses, fixed expenses to these portion here. Okay, so if we combine all these three tables, you will get to this. $240,000 from the first table, $168,000 for cost of goods sold inventory table, and the remaining is from the last one operating expenses. Okay, so all these numbers here are from the blue numbers from all the other exhibits, which the textbook also gives you, which table you can refer to. At the end, our goal is to get to this net income portion. Okay, so this 2,990 is the expected net income you can get after these four months. Okay, so we did a detailed budgets for May, for June, July, all of these and also April, add them together. This is the total expenses, total revenues, total inventory costs that we're expecting to spend and receive. At the end, you're getting operating income anticipated about 2,980. Okay, that's pretty much all I want to cover today for this new chapter. Basically, what is the budgeted income statement? What are the detailed components in it? The three main tables.